is Casey Weskin. Yes, hello? Yes, hello? I have a few questions about the Discovery Institute activity on YouTube. Okay. Who am I asking you speaking? Um, this... You probably don't know me, I'm just a small YouTube user. By the name of Q, okay. by the name of Q Dragon One Three Three Seven. Okay. Now, is it true that your company filed false DMCA's toward YouTube user Don Exodus Two? Uh, no, that's not true. I think that there's been a lot of misinformation that's been put out there. I've read of. I haven't really followed it too closely, to be honest with you, but I've read. A little bit of what's been said, and most of what has been said has been completely wrong. Uh, one of the main claims out there is that actually that I filed DMCA letters, which I did not. I have not sent any DCMA letters. So it's very clear to me that the people who are talking about this publicly either just simply don't know the facts or something else. Yeah. And so there's a lot of misinformation out there about this topic. Yes, I, I know... You personally did not send these, but did your company. Well, you have to understand what I'm saying. You see, people, I'm using this to illustrate the fact that there's a lot of false information out there. Um, the fact that I did not file these, but then people are claiming that we did, that, I'm sorry, claiming that I did, shows you how much false information there is out there. Now, there were DCMA letters sent, but they were not false DCMA letters. That's, the, uh, that's another false claim that's being made that these letters had a false premise. So, well, despite, I don't know what else there is to really say. Despite the fact that the videos in question contained copyright from Fox, not the Discovery Institute, and that they were covered under fair use. I couldn't understand what you just said. Could you say it again? I'm sorry. Please? Um, the videos in question, the, the video footage, was belonged to Fox, and they were covered under fair use. I See, I really don't think that you have any idea what these letters said or what... See, the, this just is further confirmation that people out there have no idea what the letters said, what they asked, or what the... Um, what the... Uh, what the basis of the claim was that there were problems. So this is, you know, I don't even need to go into the details of this, but I can just tell you that the information that you are, the premise of your question shows that there's just a lot of uh, wrong information, wrong assumptions about what happened here. Let me ask you a question real quick. Um, are you recording this phone call? Um, yes. Okay, um, you did not make that clear to me, and my understanding is that it actually is illegal to record a person in a phone call without informing them. So I'm hanging up this phone right now because you have made an illegal action against me, and I appreciate your time. If uh, this gets posted, uh, you should be aware that I, my understanding is that it is illegal to record a phone call without somebody's uh, knowledge or, okay. or letting I'm them know sorry. about that first. I'm so very sorry. I'm hanging up this phone because you have done something illegal. Hope you have a nice day. I have no ill will against you, and I forgive you for the illegal action that you I did against me today. Have a nice legal. day. Thank you very much. Bye. Sorry.